What are the wise decisions we need to make now in your view? Reinvest in, in rebuilding a global order. Fascism makes people see themselves as belonging to the most beautiful and most important thing in the world. If, if I could make an arrangement where um, I had a, I had a, a stand in, a front man, or front woman, and, and they had an earpiece in, and I was just in my basement in my sweats mm -hmm. looking through the stuff, and then I could sort of deliver the lines. The number one question facing us is how not to allow ourselves to be manipulated by those who control the data. People who have this kind of mystical belief in free will are the easiest people to manipulate. And I'm apolitical. I'm not invested either way. I'm not trying to promote you know, any of these systems. I just know the idea, this springs from Yuval Harari saying there's no one that came forward and offered a better system. If they would have, we would have adopted it. No, he's wrong. In fact, these fascist systems that actually did adopt things which helped the farmers and helped the workers, and it was pushed down, who, by who? Well, a well-funded, ruthless group of globalists, right? This is Olaf Scholz, he's the German, you know, pretending to be the German premier, right? So, and, and what did the German uh, premier just get caught with his finger in the cookie jar doing? Well, planning a war, again, you know, going into Ukraine and giving them weapons and then denying it, right? Denying that they were doing this. He was from the 50s, he was saying basically there's a big difference between democracy and, and a republic form of democracy, right? So they began systematically dropping off the term republic over the last de decades to kind of cunningly and deliberately move us into democracy, democracy. So democracy's become a mantra, you know, but democracy is the child of Marxism, right? And most of the liberal ideas that have their roots in Marxist ideology. The argument of his, he's saying precisely what it is that even people on the spiritual path could take a, a lot of uh, heed, you know, following, because really just, if we don't use our full functionality to reach um, a higher vision of who we are, we will just continually repeat the same patterns in the same loop.